Oh, girl, my hair. Hello, I am Mel. Welcome to my channel. I am so happy that you were here with me. I'm sure that you've seen now by the um, the title of this video that I am vlogging my tattoo today. So I am um, extremely nervous, but excited at the same time. I will um, a pop up. Hey, let me scooch a picture of um, the inspiration for my tattoo. So what makes me the most nervous about getting this tattoo is i think just because i'm a creative i don't want to call myself an artist because i don't i don't consider myself an artist i'm a photographer but i feel like artist is a bit of a stretch oh my god my hair i just i just can't right now it just it doesn't want to sit sometimes as a creative you end up having an idea in your head of how you hope that things will work out and then sometimes you know like it just it feels a little bit hard to kind of let go or that's what i feel like my thing is that it's a little bit hard to let go of that initial idea and because i and it's not going to be this straight design I kind of, it's in the hands of my tattoo artist. She is absolutely fantastic. She's done all of my other tattoos. So I've got this one and I've got, hang on, how do I show this? This one. <laughs> and then I've got another one that's like back here. And she's absolutely fabulous. So I know that I am in absolutely fantastic hands. And now I've, um, just gotta go and do it. Wish me luck. All right. Uh, uh. Okay, I am feeling a bit nervous. My hair looks like a disaster, and I um, I have a headache. Too much coffee, not enough water. What? You do a video, so oh, you're looking at your slippers, walking in your fluffy slippers. <laughs> Say hello. Hello. We are here and um, we are kind of running late. I blame him. Hey, I got you here on time. <laughs> Whatever. Matching tattoos? Matching tattoos. Yeah, no. Did you get one of these sleeves on this side? And no. Put them together? Captain Planet. No, no. No. Might as well get like matching best friend hearts. Best friends forever. Oh my gosh. Straight? Yeah. wrap a little bit but I'm not mad about it okay how do you feel I don't know I'm I'm trust I'm trusting you for size <laughs> you don't really want to do it too much like, smaller like they are a different size because they're different they're a different design yeah I can move that up but it's never gonna be symmetrical yeah you know what I mean well my arms not symmetrical 
That's yeah. not meant to really be symmetrical. No. But I feel like size-wise, like, it's a good size. Like, I don't want to do these flowers any smaller, yeah. for sure. Yeah. Okay. okay. Like where the face is, is really similar to where like the eye and the main part of the hamster is. Yeah. So I feel like that. I just didn't want it to be like off yeah. balance or anything. Nah, I think that works. Um, Go check it out in the mirror. What do we think? Yep. <laughs> Ready? That's why I need the skills that aren't the video. I should have like a bottle with like a like, like a, a straw. Yeah. Like one of those helmets. I need like one of the, the helmets with What are those the, helmets called with the straws with the, the bees in them? Yeah. Huh? Mm -hmm. So that this part of my arm hurts a lot more than the other part of my arm. Yeah, the inside. We're also a lot closer to your ditch. It's not uncommon for one side being more cool than the other. Which is weird, but it's a thing. I, I did not do this. <laughs>
has had a belt like you could have done like the Padme and Medulla, you know, the stripe in the middle of the lip. No! <laughs> it was cool at the time. I'm never asking you to help ever again. Who? I help? You should see some of the shots. They're pretty freaking perfect. Um, yeah, perfect. All my shots are perfect. Sure they are. They're the perfectest of the perfectest. Yeah. And you know, we create that music here because it's like cool, you know, yeah. Things I put up with. Yeah. <laughs> Me. <laughs> What do you think? Love it. Oh, I'm not here just yet. Why are you being a bad YouTuber? I'm not being a bad YouTuber. I get in this conversation. Why? Why this one? I don't know. Did you keep going? Recording. Huh? I don't even know how I look right now. You look pretty. As always. No, I'm looking like trash. No, you don't. Get smacked. I don't know, maybe. Why? I don't know. You're a bad YouTube husband. I'm recording everything right now. <laughs> Here we go, Lauren. Oh, I still haven't got my pizza that Lauren said I could have. <laughs> That's because I was on my channel. What pizza do you want? I don't know. Okay. Are you can get personal pants. Oh, the pizza have personal pants, pizza. Personal pan pizza. Say that ten times pretty fast. Personal pan pizza, 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 personal pan Upside down. Yeah, let's pull that. My hair's 
hair is a mess. Your hair is not a mess, it looks great. Oh, yeah. Heather, Heather Locklear. Yeah, Why do I want to look like Heather Locklear? She was hot. Yeah. She's not blonde though. Doesn't matter. <laughs> How are you feeling anyway? Fine. Yeah? It's just like there's a few bits, there's a few areas that are a bit pinchy. Pinchy? What area is that? Huh? Which area? Yeah, that's here. That's where it hurts the most. Not even there. It's like literally right here. Yeah, like you don't even make any faces either, which is crazy. Me? Yeah. Like, oh, I was when we started. Yeah, you get used to it. Eh? I'm recording myself recording. It's record section. Yep, conception. She's feeling tender. Yeah. You did really well. Yeah. <laughs> well, I didn't scream in pain like a little girl, so. I didn't do that either. And it's better than the original, so. Yes. Matter. Oh my god, a thousand Sorry. times. <laughs>
all done. So, I don't know. I'm just recording now. I don't know what I'm doing. Do I know what I'm doing in life? No, but I just got a tattoo. So, this far into the video thank you so much I appreciate you so it's been three and a half weeks since I had my tattoo done I just waited that extra little bit of time just to make sure that the tattoo was completely healed for me to show you guys I'll pop up a comparison of the inspirational picture with the finished tattoo just so you guys can see the difference so when i had originally shown lauren my inspirational image i was just like i love the bottom half of her head you know like the lip the hand resting against the chin and i'm like i i don't like the flower she's like all right flower's gone what would you like so I love peonies and hydrangeas. They're my favorite flowers. So it's just like, all right, done. I was a little bit worried because a lot of the times I've seen like tattoos and drawings of hydrangeas and they never quite capture the beauty of those flowers. So when I saw like Lauren's sketch, I was just like, oh my God, that it looks perfect like the whole design just looked so nicely balanced i'm just like yep let's do this let's go i was blown away by how amazing this tattoo turned out like i could not have imagined it to turn out more beautiful than what it did lauren just she did the most fabulous job and i could not be any more grateful to her I don't want anyone to think that I like jump into tattoos like I, I would never I'd never want to like promote anyone to just randomly go get a tattoo so please don't take that out of this vlog because to me it's it's another form of art and it's another sort of piece of me so I'm sure people are wondering if there was any sort of meaning behind the tattoo and no, there's no specific meaning. It's, it's me symbolizing beauty and creativity. So tattoos don't really have to have meaning, but you still want it to sort of be something that you will enjoy because you're going to be stuck with it for a very long time. <laughs> regards to pain, like I'm not going to lie and say that it was painless because it wasn't. <laughs> But uh, the most painful area was probably just along here. It felt sort of like really pinchy is kind of the word that I describe. It's probably very wrong, but oh well. And that's where she actually started as well. So, but once you get going, you kind of just build up that pain tolerance while you're going. So by the end, it, it's not too bad, but again like my the tattoo itself took about two hours um we ended up taking a break just after the line work was finished and then took another break not too long after because another client had come in to get numbing done this video was a little bit of an experiment so i haven't really vlogged before but i've really wanted to do it and i thought that Getting my tattoo done was the perfect excuse to try it. So neither my husband and I have gimbals. <laughs> so everything was handheld or like this camera was put up on a tripod to be able to do the time lapses. So hopefully it all worked out all right. It was, it was an interesting time to put it together. I, I thank you guys so much for watching and yeah. Hopefully I'll bring you guys some more soon and have a lovely rest of your day. That's it for me. So bye guys. Mwah.